Stop what you're doing. I've got these results with a free trading view strategy and the best part, it only uses two indicators. Let me show you how. So in this video, I'm not going to waste any more of your time. Make sure you click the subscribe button, click the like button and click the first link down in the comments to let me personally mentor you. So first, you're going to want to go on tradingview.com. Next, we're going to head up to indicators up here. And if you've read the title, the first indicator that we are going to be using is the UT bot alert indicator. So type in UT bot alert and it is this indicator right here by Quant Nomad. Add that once to your chart. Click on the settings for this indicator and for the key value, we're going to set that to two. This changes the sensitivity overall of the buy sell indicator. And for the ATR period, set that to one make sure that you have the signals from Heiken Ashi Candles turned off. And on the style, I have turned off the bar colors. This buy and sell indicator is by far one of the best. And these are some of the best settings that I've found for getting them perfect entries when other confirmations align with it. Okay, and for the second indicator, we're gonna go up to indicators again. And just before I show you how to add it, let me show you why Flux Charts is the best in the business. They wanted to sponsor today's video to show you how powerful their premium indicators actually are. I have previously tested them on this channel and had insane results. And for only the price of one takeaway a month, you could gain access to life-changing indicators and an amazing community of other like-minded traders, all the way from beginner to expert, that are making money the same way you want to. So check them out risk-free with the first link down in the description and in the comments section and seeing exactly how much value they cram into this tiny membership fee. Flux Charts has been very generous to offer you a 20% off if you use code MO at checkout. So please, please go check them out for yourself. And thank you again to Flux Charts for sponsoring today's video. For the second indicator, we're going to go up to indicators again. And it is the MA Sabre indicator by Lux Algo. And these are the settings for it right here, but I have left it default, so yours should look like this as well. Okay, so there is a couple of rules for trading this strategy. The first rule, of course, is that we want to focus on trading during main sessions. For this strategy, I am trading the five minute chart on Bitcoin USD. So naturally, we'll be focusing on the New York session, but trading the US session will mean we have the most volume and the most liquidity to be able to catch the best possible trends when trading. Now we have the red and green buy and sell labels. This is the UT bot alerts indicator. For the MA Sabre indicator, we have these little red and blue curves. And then we have this gray line behind the candles, which is a 50 moving average. Now this is a very simple strategy, but it does provide very good results, especially for beginners looking to trade a very simple strategy. But let's get into the rules for taking a trade. Now the first rule for this strategy is we will be in session. So depending on your pair will depend on which session you will trade. Like I said, I'm on Bitcoin USD, so we'll be focusing on the US session. Step two for this strategy is to wait for a UT bot alert indicator to paint. This is the red and green buy and sell labels, but we can't just enter any buy and sell that we like. We have to wait for a couple more things to set up first. Now that the sell label is painted, we can see the red MA Sabre has painted right here. And this indicates that we are now in a downward direction and we can start looking for cells. Now, a few candles later, we do get our second cell for the UT bot alert. But once the MA Sabre line has painted, we then want to see price move back towards this Sabre line, reject off it and then paint the entry signal, which is the UT bot alert cell label. And this would be our valid entry. Enter your cell on the close of the candle here. Now for your stop loss, I want you to drag that up to the recent swing high or the recent swing low, depending on the direction. I'm going to put it just above this recent swing high right here. Now for taking profits, we won't actually have a fixed zone or a fixed risk to reward, but in fact, we will be using a trailing stop method to catch as many pips possible with the trend. And there we go, that trade is at our take profit and we can finally close out at a 3.19 risk to reward ratio. We achieved this risk to reward ratio by waiting for the candle to respect the moving average line, the grey 50 line behind the candles. And for our exit strategy, we are waiting for price to cross up again and close above that 50 moving average line. On the close of this candle right here, it did actually close above. 
so we were safe to exit our trade. Now price may sometimes retest the moving average before continuing down, but a 3 risk to reward ratio in this circumstance definitely is more than profitable, and overall I've had the best results doing it this way. Okay, so in the US session, we have had another Sabre line paint, but this time it is a blue indicating a buy trend. And a few candles later, we can see that price wicked off of the Sabre line right here, completely rejecting it before pulling up and making a buy signal for entry. So we'd enter our long position here. For the stop loss this time, the swing glow is actually just before the Sabre line, so I've put it just after it. And now let's see where this trade goes. Remember to watch and wait for price to close back below this 50 moving average line and once it's closed below it we can exit our trade. And there we go, price hit take profit again, this time for a 2.32 risk to reward ratio. So overall this is a very good outcome so far. And you can also see that straight after the close of this trade right here we have our UT sell label paint with a Sabre line marking just before on the previous candle. And because we're right at the end of the US session, we can actually enter this trade. So let's buy our stop loss above the recent swing high and see where this one goes as well. And there we go, we finally pulled our trade out on that one. This time only scoring a 0.24 risk to reward. We definitely don't want to see a lower than one risk to reward ratio. One thing I definitely would recommend doing is only manually closing out the trades when they are in profit. If price tells you to close out but the trade is negative, I definitely would let it run and see if it can catch that trend and carry on in the bias direction. Remember that is what our stop loss is for and we should only ever risk as much as we're willing to lose. Results time! Please hit that like button and that subscribe button if you enjoyed this strategy. I try to make these as simple as possible so any beginner to expert can understand and I am trying to focus more on two indicators so that everyone using the free trading view plan can enjoy the profits as well. Okay, and these are the results for the strategy. And you can see we had a 61% win rate, starting at $100 in the account. And we made a very, very impressive 248% profit on the account. Over 100 trades, we had 61 wins and only 39 losses, giving us a profit factor of 4.28 absolutely amazing if you've enjoyed this strategy please again hit that subscribe button and check out that first link down in the comments but i've got two very good videos here for you if you want to check one of these out and if not then i usually upload every other day so i'll see you guys in the next video thank you very much for clicking and have a wonderful day